Hey, it's Heather and Emily, and today is Mother Daughter Day. So she had a doctor's appointment, so we decided to meet in a parking lot in front of Ulta. And so we're gonna do, we're gonna take you along with us. Um, my plan is to go into Ulta and we're gonna go next door to Versona. And some of you have been asking me to do a Walmart clothing haul, so we are going to go over to Walmart and I'm gonna check out and see what they've got. Okay, so we did not uh, film inside of Ulta because you're really not supposed to and it's weird. Yeah, they don't like when you do that. So I have a tiny little bag. I actually want this um, hand cream called Crepe Erase and they were out of stock in there. Of course they were because that's what I want to look. But I have very old looking hands. It feels and, really nice. And it's not greasy. So um, I think I'm going to try to find that online. I did buy a leopard printed Invisibobble. I like that. I use the Invisibobbles. I have, if I put a ponytail in, it's ridiculous. I mean, I have this little bitty, tiny, I'm still taking my vitamins, but yeah. Um, and I got two nail polish colors, mainly for my toes. But I'm thinking if I felt like covering up this, I could. So I just bought an Essie, what is it called, Blank? Yeah, Blank. And then one by La Lacquer. And it's called Crowning Crumpet. And that was my big spend at Ulta today. How did you get? I got a little bag. Do you have matching bags? And this is, I think, the smallest bag we've ever had leaving there. Yeah. I got blank. Same one. I have it already, but I'm almost out. And then I have Limitless Lashes by Ulta. Because they got, um, I actually like their mascara. Um, and then this brand I've never heard of. It's I, called The Ordinary. I introduced her to it today. The Ordinary, and they have really odd prices, really good prices, but like $7.70 and $7.90. Yeah, it's which like, one was that? That was the cream? This is the Natural Moisturizing Hydrators and Oils. Natural Moisturizing Factors. Plus I'm trying to teach her to take care of her skin while she's young, so I'm she doesn't pretty end up good with at my taking problems. care of my skin. Yeah, just yeah. saying. I taught you well. This is the ordinary um, vitamin this, C, right? It's the Reservatrol, three percent, and ferulic acid, three percent. Oh, okay. And then this is supposed to help with antioxidants. This is just the cleanser. Let's see if it'll. Nope. Okay. So. She would like to find a kit where she could do her own French manicures and they didn't have anything in there. So we are going to drive into Peachtree City further, and which is a little ways away, not in the area where we're gonna shop at yeah. at Walmart. We're gonna go to Sally's and see what they have. And we may hit the target there for a quick sec and we're gonna grab some lunch. And then we're gonna come back over here and I think Walmart will be our last stop, but be prepared. Yeah. I'm gonna do some clothing shopping and stuff in there too. Well, real quick, um, the reason I wanna do my own French is because my nails are getting quite long again and um, every time I go into the nail salon and I say hey I don't want to cut them back They're like but we got to straighten them up I'm like okay straighten them up don't cut them back and then I walk out with half my nails yeah so I'm gonna do it myself <laughs> so she's trying to figure figure out a way to do it where it looks good and she can do it on her own quite easily so yes all right we will check in with you in a little bit hey guys so we went to Sally's and uh, <clears throat> I'm sorry <clears throat> I got a couple little like bedazzles that you can put on your nails um, hoping this is the tool it's like those cuticle cutters problem is is the way they did the packaging I can't really see what's in there but I think that's what it is um, these will help <clears throat> <clears throat> With the, I don't know what's going on. With the French, they're like the little stickers that help guide where you need to put the polish on. Um, this is the little tool that is gonna help me get the little gems out. These are so cute. So these are Halloween stickers that I'm gonna put on top of. One minute glow in the dark it glows in the dark I think that's kind of cute there we go <laughs> um, another white nail polish has a thinner 
um, brush so that it'll help go on a little bit easier. And then I think last but not least, I got this Callus Terminator. This stuff works so well. It really does. Um, and I know I've got another another buffer, but can never have enough buffers. <clears throat> so yeah. I didn't get anything. I didn't need anything this time, so she's this was a trip for her. We are gonna go where we're we going for lunch. No idea. Alright, so we're gonna go find some lunch in the bathroom. We'll see y'all. Yes. We'll see y'all in a while. Okie dokie. <laughs> <laughs> we're trying not to say the word all right because I use that word a lot. So we're switching it to okie dokie. Anyway, <laughs> okie dokie. We just had Subway for lunch. Haven't had Subway in a long I time. It's really good. I feel like I did better decision wise, although I did eat some um, sour cream and onion chips. It just sounded good. And a cookie. Because it sounded good. Yep. Gotta have that shopping energy, right? Yep. We are headed back to the other side of Peace Street City, and it's quite early. I mean, it's uh, it's just now lunchtime. Yeah, it's 11.30. But we so. are going to Wally World, and I have a feeling we're going to be in there for a minute or two. So we're going to head back there and see what they've got. I've been hearing about their clothing line, um, and I'm interested. I don't... I tend to not shop a lot at Walmart only because there's so that like, you can't find a parking spot. The lines to check out are always a pain in the butt. So but ever since we bought the RV, I have found myself at Walmart more. And they have a great selection of RV supplies, RV toilet paper and all of that. So I'm got to get over how packed it is and the classic, you know, Buggy, you know, when you're running into people, what am I here? The, the buggy jam, the cart jam. There you go. So we're gonna go and see what they've got. We're gonna check out the clothing and I'm gonna see if I can maybe get a full outfit or something, you know, from there that I like. Something a little more cost effective, you know, try to find some things, especially for camping. Now, I've recently bought a couple of sweatshirts and thermals in the mindset of taking them with me on the RV. But when you look at the price tag on some of those, you're thinking, yeah, I'm, you know, not exactly gonna get dirty in it. So finding a few items that are lesser expensive and still look really nice and what put together is my goal today. So that's what we're gonna go do. See what Walmart's got. Um, I love their sleepwear. Yes, I have a, look at the camera when you talk. I have a sweatshirt that I bought, what, last year? It's like nine dollars and some odd cents. I think it was nine dollars. Anyways, it is probably nine dollars and eighty-eight cents. Probably, um, but it's burgundy. It's so soft, and it says "snuggle" right across the front. And I think it was from the sleep department. I yeah, remember it was. You getting it. I think they actually yep. had like sleep pants that you could buy to coexist with it. Yeah, I don't need to match at night. Just gonna wear some shorts and a shirt. I like to be put together when I wake up in the morning. And truthfully, I had mentioned uh, I will be doing a Nordstrom haul video coming up. Uh, the second box arrived yesterday, so I'm hoping everything that I ordered is in it. I am looking for pajamas that I can wake up in the morning on the RV and go outside and have coffee and still feel okay without having to get fully dressed. Because what I wear at home. Well, I mean, I'm talking about going into the fall and stuff. You know, I'm not going to be going outside in a tank top, no bra, and little short shorts. But it's not going to do that in public. So I've got a couple well, of sets of pajamas coming from them. I plan on keeping one of the two. I think they're virtually identical, just different brands. The problem is long pants tend to be very long on my legs. So check out the Walmart sleep section today. I want to check out their shoes and their clothing. And I actually am interested in a couple of flower beauty blushes. So I'm gonna check out their makeup section too. I'm so gonna check out their up. food section. <laughs> She's gotta go grocery shopping. Yes, so, and I've gotta get <clears throat> some cough drops for Connor. His throat's been bugging him for a little while now, so he's going to need some. He likes the Fisherman Friends, which is like the end all be all of all of the cough drops. They taste horrible, but they do the job so he always every time I have a sore throat I try not to tell him anymore because he's like take a fisherman friends and he won't leave me alone until I do so I went to the wrong spot yep 
and I'm going to fix that. So, yeah, I don't like taking them because it is a taste that you can get out of your mouth. It takes a very long time to get that taste you out of your mouth. You need to get some throat spray to have on hand, too. Yes, yes. So just remind me to get stuff like that. We will probably pull the camera out while we're in Walmart and just kind of let you see what we're seeing and how we how I pick or what I pick. So, and then whatever I purchase, maybe I'll do a try on haul. That may be done at Emily's house because it's early. It looks like we're gonna finish up our shopping early oh today. Oh God, I gotta go home and clean. So, but we can go home. You can put the groceries away, and then you can do a try on haul for me. I'm not getting you can any film me. Oh, I was like, I'm not getting it. You know, maybe you, you can try some stuff on for I'll me. I'll try it on. She can film it because normally Adam films it for me. All right, Lotsa. I just said already again. <laughs> Okie dokie. We'll see you in Walmart. All right. All right. Okie dokie. So we're here at the Wally World. Headed in now so that uh, we can go shopping. It's actually not as busy right now. The parking lot's not Yeah. Full. You see these spots? Except for over there. That's why we came over here. Okay, Emily has already found jackets. Uh, no, I don't need a beige colored jacket. Okay. I'm not, no, I don't want like a fleece jacket. I'm more interested in. Just to throw on in the morning if you're letting the dogs out. It's got a nice, cool design. It's more like a sweatshirt. I like this better over here. These, uh. Oh, no, I do like that better. Look, this one's got cheetah on the inside. It's got a long tail in the back, though. Yeah. I don't know how I feel about that. I'll make it not rain on your booty. These are $21.96. Cheetah on the inside. Oh, the, the rust colored one has a cheetah on the inside too. Like the Ooh, colors. that's pretty. I guess I'm going to have to try. No, uh, maybe not. I guess I'll try a large. I think it's going to be really long. Yeah. You can try it. Try It'll it on. Cute. Well, we'll go look at the pillows. She's already looking at the home goods. That's what she does. I prefer that stuff. All right. I'm not really, really sure what I'm here to look for. I kind of like this little. That's cute. Again, it's really long. It is really long. Is Am I in a tall section? This is a 15 to 17. So this is junior sizes. 15, I don't know what that means. That's an extra large. And I don't have the extra large and extra extra large in that color. And I'm not big on these other colors. Oh no, I left my phone in the car. So Emily had to run back out of the car. She left her phone in the car and she has her shopping list on it. So I'm just looking at the clearance sections right now. I think this is like, it says ladies active, but I don't think it is. Well, I guess it is. A lot of juniors here. So I'm gonna try to push her cart and my cart. At the same time, it's not working very well. Let me just pull into this little area. I'll move her cart here. All right, I'm in the next little, seeing no boundaries, leggings. What I'm trying to do is just find something that kind of floats my boat that gets me curious I just don't know what I'm looking for I do like the t-shirt over there it says my dog thinks I'm kind of a big deal and my battery's flashing so let me change my battery all right so these are like windbreakers and here's some very very bright fleece like wubby full pullovers but I don't need another one of those I just got that one from the Nordstrom sale this is kind of a cute little sweatshirt. Well, just a cozy sweatshirt and a leopard print. It has a black band at the bottom. Black band. But I don't know. I don't know. It still says 1517. So I feel like this is still junior. 7 to 9. So I think I'd be a large. And it's kind of the black ones and the gray ones and the white one are fleece. There's a mustardy one over there this one's more like a sweatshirt material not quite so fleecy this is a sofia vergara mm, has the evil eye on the arm 
here. There she is. And it's got like little balloon sleeves. This is Sofia Vergara. Oh, that's cute. That's like cute. That. Here's your key. Thank you. <laughs> I'm just gonna, here, take the camera for a second. Woo! Let's keep the strap around your wrist. I don't wanna have to buy a new camera. <laughs> All right. So this section, other than that sweatshirt, I have that one that I got from Nordstrom last week, or a couple months ago, a month ago. I don't think there's anything on this aisle. And I don't do printed leggings, although those are cute. Look at the little cheetah ones. Oh, they're really soft. Super soft, high rise legging. Just with my shape of legs. Yeah, I don't think so. I'm a fox. Emily likes that one. Wife, mom, witch. You know what I'm really happy about in this section? What? One of them says, I'm a mermaid. Well, I'm a unicorn. Yeah, it's different, not a mermaid. Happy Halloween. So if you had an ugly Halloween sweater party, here we go. It lights up. I see the little bulbs around it. Yeah. Well, okay, well, it doesn't work. No, it does. I just can't get to it. So. There we go. This is my awesome grandma costume. Cute. Oh wait, here is this. This color again. I do like this color. What would that be considered like a Tuscan or Tuscan red? I'm gonna call it pumpkin spice. Uh, I'm gonna try. This is the large 11 to 13. It's got a hood on it. I don't know, we'll have to try it on and see how I feel about it. That's not pumpkin spice, it's like a rusted pumpkin spice. Okay. And now we are in the Time and True brand. Look at this. Oh, that's cute, Emily. That's a great color for you too. You should try one on. Now. Yes. Now. I kind of like these little sweatshirts. $10.88. I like I this color. color. Look at this color. That is pretty good. Well, that sage is this pretty. This right here. It's a nice palette. <laughs> yeah, I like that palette color too. That is a pretty color. Here's a medium. What is the medium size? Eight to 10? All right, we'll try it on. I may would want something. May would? I may would want this to be a little larger. Well, here's a large in like the... Here's a large in the sage. Ah, I'll try both of those on. I like my sweatshirts to fit a little bit loose. All right. I'm, I'm gonna try that color too. I really like this color as well. And these would be great for camping, especially for $10.88. Yes. No, that would be a perfect Beverly Goldberg sweater. Oh my goodness. I just add a little bedazzle to it. Oh my goodness. That's funny. All right. These are like a thermal Henley. I'm interested in these. So I'm gonna try, it says semi-fitted. I like this color. Oh, turtleneck, not for me, for you. And I'd like it in a kind of a white, a winter white, which they have over here. Size four, six, there's a medium. I don't know if I need to hold this, hold that, me, that, lot, that medium up. These are eight dollars and eighty-eight cents. Small. That looks very small. It does look small. But throw, throw very the medium small. in there, and I'm gonna try it in a large as well. So I'm thinking jeans and maybe a flannel or a cardigan oh, over that. This color on. All right, I've got the rusty colored in there too. I do like these. These would be so great with leggings or jeans for camping. Yeah. And I really like this color too. Please. I've got one right there. Oh, all right. And that is so much a Beverly Goldberg sweater. You just need to put some like little gems down here. 
That's hysterical. Let's take a look at their jeans. Mid-rise boot cut, high-rise skinny. Are they in a order? Mid-rise skinny, is that this? Oh, and they even have petites. There's a six petite. I don't know, it depends on how much stretch they have. 14 petite. Hmm, no eight petite. Eight fitted. 18 petite, 10 petite, six petite. Seems like the eight petites are probably a very popular size. I'll try a six. It's probably gonna need to be an eight. Oh, well, these look, these look really skinny. Let's come back since it's so crowded here. Let's go look at the shoes. I think it's gonna be this way. I'm looking for more like slip on type that catch my eye. Like a true slip on? Tennis shoe type thing. Okay. These are cute. Aren't those cute? Mm-hmm. I got a six down there and a six and a half. Mm, okay. I also like oh, this mustard. Seven and a half, seven. There's a six and a half. We'll try those on. There's some white slip-ons over there and some black slip-ons. Uh, I like these little quilted teddies right here. Seven, try the seven on. More of a six and a half, so. There is a six and a half, and I even like the burgundy. Do they have a six and a half in the burgundy? They do. The cheetah's cute, the black's are cute, but I, I prefer the burgundy and the olive green. These are, I love the color, but it's a weird shape. I feel like they'd be hard to get on with those backs being like well, that. Yeah, but look at the shape of the foot. It looks more like a child's foot. Yeah, it's like a big old oval. Yeah. <laughs> There's no shape to it. Those look just like heads right there. Yeah. Okay, so these are the six. She said that the six and a half felt a little big, so the sevens are definitely not gonna work. So these feel slightly small, but I'm wondering if they're gonna be the type of thing that stretches Most out. Most likely. If I wore little sockies with them, I just would like to be able to walk to see. <laughs> I really like this burgundy color. I like the olive color too. Let me turn the six and a half on one more time. Because if I wore socks with this one, I probably wouldn't though. But maybe some no-shows. Do I want them to be, I need like a six and three fourths. <laughs> I mean, no, I'm you sorry. need a six and one fourth. Six and one fourth. Those are gonna come right off. You can see the, the gapes in the sides and the back, yeah. <laughs> These are enough. So. Now it's time to decide between colors. We put all this stuff. Olive. Apart. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> so I would say they run slightly large. I, I like the olive. I need a solid six and a half. How much are they? I don't know. $14.88. That's pretty good. That's pretty darn good. Right, I'm going to put both pairs of these. Let me go ahead and try these on while I'm standing here. These 
don't think are necessary right now, but too big. So the Tom and True brand shoes seem to run, I mean, that's significant. You can wow. see down my heel. Yeah. So I would definitely need a six. They're cute, aren't they? They are. But I don't think I'm gonna wear bright yellow shoes or mustard yellow shoes. Okay, holy crap, these camisoles are a dollar sixty-eight. A dollar sixty-eight. The time and shoe brand, a dollar sixty-eight. You know what? I like this one. Did you feel how soft this is? Yeah, I know. I know you like that. I mean, I like that too. But I, I like these colors. Let's see. I think that large is too large. Um, I don't like the way these are sewn together. See that in all the armpits? Oh, they don't look very well made. This one hides it. I like this color. I'm gonna try it on just to see if that shows when you've got it on. And I guess I'll try on this one as well. You want to try that one on? Yes. All right, you try it on. <laughs> okay, oh we are walking gosh. into the Those pajama so department. Soft. Yes, this is this is the mix and match. Who makes this? Secret Treasures. I had. I have their stuff. I gave you my the, what I, the stuff that I Not had. Cream. This See, is this is exactly, like what you had. Yeah, it's just burgundy and has white or cream. Baby. This one says yawn. Here, look. Coffee and chill. This is the same color as yours. No, mine's a little deeper. A little deeper burgundy? Okay. Yeah. But look, <laughs> yawn. I just showed you this one right here. Oh. <laughs> Gray. They have these in a medium, but I don't feel like you'd like those. No. I, I can't reach these, but I feel like you may like those. <laughs> I like this one better. Okay. Well, here's all the mediums that I have pulled up from you. Okay. So, so too thin. Oh, the pink camo's cute too. Oh my goodness gracious. I have to go back and get a bunch of camisoles to go with them. Those are cute. Hi, yeah, yeah, yeah. Regular Emily. gray. I have some regular gray. Um, I like not so much in the koalas. Burgundy. The burgundy is a possibility. They're so soft. Okay, possible. And then that latte. Which latte do you like better? Yeah, those, those, those. Okay, now they are a different feeling. These are thick. Well, then you need. Oh, God. They're like a velour. <laughs> And these are like a Those cotton. These are unbelievably so, soft. These are unbelievably breathable. Right. So this is a now, and this is a later. A now and, a now and later. And look, mm -hmm. these have little gingerbread cookies. Mm -hmm. All right, well, let's just put them both in here for now, and I will make my decision. These I'll let like y'all know later what I decide. These are the super soft ones. Yeah, I like the other ones I have over here better. Yeah, because I, I didn't I didn't know if you'd like those, but it was mainly the texture that I was like, ooh. Okay, so oh, now. Little penguins. Nope, I'm, I like what we've got. You did really, really well. So did you see this color feeling good? In medium? No, for you. I want you to try some stuff on. Well, I like this happy. Try it on. But I know you like happy. Well. I like the yawn. Yes. I like the nap queen. What I want to do is find a couple of tops that will go with a couple of these bottoms. They don't have the feeling good in my That size. is not like a, you know, what size are you looking for? Oh, look, this is, let's get cozy. That's cute. And it's not too thick either. No, these are always the comfortable. All right, we'll check in in a minute. Okay, as I thought, the, I would need this at a medium. It's quite large. That is really, really low. Uh, and I wonder if a medium would be, maybe when I head in that, I'll try that black one on that has a leopard on the inside. Love the color. Maybe I'll try ordering this online. And seeing because this zipper, I could do a medium quite easily. Show, take that off and show them just the shirt. This is, I really like that shirt. I like the color too. I like <clears> the, <throat> the three quarter length sleeves. I like the boat neck. I do like this. I think this is really cute. It's very cute. Okay, so she's still trying stuff on, but she has decided on these, these three. And then these are the nose so far. And it's mainly because of this seam right here on this shirt. That's just not good. Um, I believe this is the blue version of that. Same with the sleeves, the colors didn't wow me. And then the black and white. 
but I think she is gonna get the beigey ones, so we'll see. Okay, so she walked out and said, I don't like this, and she walked out and I said, ooh, I really like that. On the camera, it actually doesn't look that good on the camera, but I don't like in person it looks, band. I like it. And I'm doing that for Thank you. All right, I lied. Thank you. Okay. We literally just spent over two hours in Walmart. We tried on a bunch of really cute stuff. Now, I really wanted to try the Time and True skinny jeans. Not the super skinny. Um, they didn't, uh, yeah, you saw, I, I have a clip of me looking at them. I don't like how they fit, and the waist of them are this big, and I, I just, you know, and I've got some pairs of jeans anyway. Yeah. I ended up buying a sweatshirt, thermal, a sweater, and mainly pajamas and then the two pairs of shoes. She ended up getting the sweatshirt that said Yawn. Yawn. <laughs> and, a, and a couple of tops, some really cute long suits. I didn't even try the black. Well, you just tried the stripe one on. Yeah. It really good, so. so she got a few things, I got a few things, and then I, I maybe I'll add to this video when I get home just that the different makeup things that I want to try from Flower Beauty. I was interested in a few of their items. And then we got some groceries. So since we were in the ground looking for her, you actually can't see it and see it's down. Oh, <laughs> well mine's on the way back because once we go over to the Ulta area, I gotta drop gonna... her off at her car and then she's gonna head home so she can put away her groceries. And I have frozen goods and milk and stuff in here too, so Sick. I gotta take mine home too. So it's gonna be a little short, but that's okay. We do that from time to time. Yeah. But all right. So turn it around. So I may put a little ad, a little clip when I get home of the flower beauty stuff that I've tried, that I've, I bought today, and um, maybe I'll have her send me a picture of a few of the things that she did. So anyway, thank you guys for spending some time with us today, and this is our, our weekly Mother Daughter Day almost every single week. Yeah. We'd love that. Very rarely is it not, if right. it's like some vet appointment or something weird well, happens, or out of town. I usually to the vet or something. Yeah. And one of us sometimes is out of town, and that, that yeah. happens. But I always have fun with her. Same. All right, well, we will see you in our next video. I hope you guys have a very happy day and come back and see us next time. Bye. Bye. Okay, so I showed you everything else I got at Walmart uh, clothing wise. I just got done showing my husband. These are from Target. That's from another day. Um, I got another bottle of the Hydra Boost body gel cream. I love this stuff. And I decided to try some Flower Beauty products. It's hard to pick your color when you can't sample it. This is the Light Illusion, which going into winter, I'd like things to have a little bit of like a, almost a glossy, not glossy, you know what I'm trying to say, a sh dewy look on my face. This one is called the Natural Beige. I'm hoping, because I looked at the next shade darker and it looked orange. So I'm gonna try that. I'm trying the Flower Beauty Miracle Glow Satin Finish Powder. They had a matte and I don't think matte will work for me, but I don't really need this right now, but I wanted to try it with this just so I can see how I like this. I did decide to try the Tattoo Effect Brow Vixen tat, um, Brow Stain. This is in the color Taupe. It says 24 hour, 24 hour wear, 12 hour wear, smudge proof, right there. And I chose this blush shade. This is Warm Hibiscus. I just thought it was a really pretty, kind of going into fall kind of a rose, not even a rose. I don't know, it's, it's, I just thought it was really pretty. So, and then the only thing I either got was a nail glue because every once in a while I need it and the last time I opened one, it was dry. So, the only thing I, over here, you already saw this. This is Ulta, my Invisible Bobble, and my two little thingamabobbers. So, um, I picked up some groceries, already have them put away. The donkeys don't deliver me when I get home. And I think that's it. So I'm gonna close out this video. Emily is back at her house unloading groceries and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.